Today, we are going to explore why planets, including our Earth, are round in shape. To start with, let's understand that planets are not perfectly round. They are an oblate spheroid shape. This oblate spheroid is caused by the planet's rotation. Now let's dive deeper into the factors that make planets round. When planets are formed, they start as a large chaotic cloud of gas and dust. Gravity is the main actor, pulling everything towards the center of mass. As more material is drawn in, the cloud begins to collapse and form a dip. The force of gravity is equally strong in all directions towards the center. This creates a spherical shape as it is the most energy efficient shape under gravity. Now let's consider another factor. Heat generated from the gravitational collapse of the planet. This heat melts the planet, allowing it to form into a liquid-like state. In a liquid-like state, a body will naturally take the shape that has the least surface area, a sphere. The rotation of the planet also plays a part in its final shape. As the planet rotates, it experiences a force known as centrifugal force. This force pushes outwards and is stronger at the planet's equator than at the poles. Due to the centrifugal force, the planet bulges at the equator and flattens at the poles, creating an oblate spheroid. This is why Earth and other planets are not perfectly round, but slightly squashed at the poles. For very slow rotating bodies like the Moon, the shape is almost a perfect sphere. But for faster rotating bodies like Jupiter, the oblateness is more noticeable. So the roundness of a planet depends on gravity, heat, and rotation. All these processes happened billions of years ago in our solar system. They formed the round or oblate spheroid planets we see today. Now, when you look at the sky, you'll understand why planets are round. Remember, it's the interplay of gravity, heat, and rotation that gives them their shape. And that's the fascinating journey of why planets are round.